Hi everyone. So today we're going to do a hive split of uh, native um, sugar bag uh, bees, uh, Tetraconula carbonara. And we have an original hive, which is probably about a year old, uh, brought from Sydney in fact, to here in uh, South East Queensland. And we're going to split the hive into a new box uh, and establish a new hive. So this is the first time we've done this, so uh, uh, bear with us. So the first, first step is to uh, weigh the uh, original hive to make sure that actually it's uh, established enough to be able to sustain a split, which I'm fairly confident will be the case, but let's just get the uh, hive out and weigh it. Okay, here we go. Okay, 9.9 kilos. So that's most definitely heavy enough for a split. So we'll just um, move that out of the way. Yeah. We'll turn it around so it's at least facing this way. First step is to take this old strap off. These straps are used to hold the hive together. Um, the bees will glue these hives together, uh, but w when you've after the split, you'll need to basically strap it up. Now, if you just grab the little hive tool over there, Katie, the little yellow hive tool, we'll um, see if we can open it up. So basically, we need to separate the bottom from the top two. Uh, top two and it will be difficult because this hive has been there for a fair while and you can hear that because that's all the resin that the bees have put there to seal the nest which is what they do to protect themselves from insects and the like and pests so okay that is looking quite good so I'm going to turn it around so that we can see clearly when we split the hive in half. Okay, here we go. Get ready for a big lot of bees. Okay, here we go. Okay. Okay, so well, what have we got? Wow. Here we go. That looks perfect. That's a really, really good split. So let's wow. just bring this over here for the minute. So the first thing we need to do is just bring some of this stuff into here and just clean these clean these edges so that uh, we have a nice nice clean area just so that when we put the hive back together we don't have any foreign stuff here that will allow pests to get in. Well, I guess we're all grateful at this point that they don't sting. Okay. What's that? Let's now... Speed it up. We put this top onto the new bottom. I got one in my ear. <laughs> Actually, I oh, got it ran the wrong way. Just. <laughs> oh, I got one in my ear. Get your ticket. <laughs> okay. Let's just grab this. <laughs> yeah, they do bite. They don't sting, but they do bite. So let's just put this on here. Okay. It's slightly. That's all good. So the old new bottom, new top. That's going to go over here. Oh. Just grab Katie's stand. I oh, will swap stands, it doesn't matter, they're both the same. It doesn't matter. 
this, this stand has been here for a fair while. It's nice and stable. Okay, there we go, guys. I know you're not happy about any of that. Uh, where's Katie's new lid? The roof. Quite tricky, I might have to take this. Oh, cool. Let's just pop that on the top of this hive. Yeah, looks pretty good. All right. Okay, Robin, let's, um, let's close up this hive. What were we going to do?